Hey everybody, it's Karen from 50 is the New 50 blog and today I'm going to do a really fun summer date night look. Full face with eyes, everything, bronzer, just everything's here in my palette from Mascara Beauty. So let's get started. So first thing I'm going to do is go in and color correct and conceal and I'm going to use my multitasker brush with a little bit of walnut contour. Yes, isn't that weird? I'm using walnut which is a little bit of a taupey shade and it actually is almost exactly the same shade as some of these dark spots I have. I also like to use it on my nose where I have some pores and across this area here where I have some larger pores. So I'm going to do that first. I'm going to put a little bit of that walnut is on my eyelids where I have a really a lot of hyperpigmentation and this is just going to kind of color correct them and also work like almost like a primer for my Bella bronzer and my glow illuminator underneath my main foundation. I'm going to use my blush and bronzer brush and just swirl the two together and it's going to pick up quite a bit but I really want to lay down a really nice bronzed look underneath my main foundation today or my main makeup and if you get too much like that just flip the brush over and just start blending and it will just blend and disperse out so nicely. So I'm going to put this all over my face, down bronzer with the glow illuminator and just put that all over my face and neck and a little bit down onto my chest just to kind of give myself a little summer glow. All right, so now I'm going to grab my detail hack brush and I'm going to pick up a little bit of my contour shade and I'm going to come up here and just define and add just a little bit more of a shadow up here at the top of my forehead, kind of working that into my hairline and down. Just a bit. I've already got the Bella bronzer up here so I don't need to use as much of my foundation or my contour. So I'm just going to put that up here and I'm going to come and do my cheeks. So I'm going to start out on my ear and just scoop it up just right out underneath and I'll do the other side. Now I'm going to catch just a little bit of contour underneath my jaw and pull that down. Now I'm going to grab the other side of my blush and bronzer brush and pick up some of my main highlight which is mango and I'm just going to come in and just apply a bit. I don't need to use as much like I said because I already have the Bella bronzer down but I definitely need it on that red nose and underneath my eyes where I have some under eye discoloration and then down here along my jaw. the other side of my detail hack brush and just pick up a little bit of this sunlit highlight to add a little bit of brightener just right up in the center of my forehead here then that fan that out bring a little bit down my nose and then I'm going to put just a little bit underneath my eye area just kind of on the inside where it's a little darker and then just take that brush and just fan that a little bit of brightener out towards the outside of my eye and then we'll blend all that in. Just kind of going underneath that area where I have a little bit of indentation, a little bagginess there. <clears throat> then I'm going to go ahead and flip over and use this side of my blush and bronzer brush and just press that in. So I'm going to use two different lip and cheek colors to come up with a really gorgeous, fun summer night date cheek color. I'm going to use black cherry and a little bit of Tropicana. I know, isn't that just beautiful? So I'm going to first kind of do my lips with a little bit of black cherry and my multitasker brush. This is a different one that I use just for my lips. And I'll go in and just fill those in. So I have the black cherry on my lips and then I'm going to use just a little bit of that Tropicana just in the bottom center of my lip. Now for my cheeks, I'm going to dab my finger into the black cherry and the Tropicana. So I'm going to put that right on my cheeks and then I'll go in and add in between a little bit of the Tropicana. So just kind of mixing it on my cheek and then I'll grab my blush and bronzer brush and just take that blush end and just tap that to kind of mix the two together. 
I go ahead and do my eyebrows with my hotline brush which has a spoolie and the angled end and I'm going to pick up some of my contour that's already in my compact and I'm going to outline the bottom of my brow and then bring it out for a little bit of a tail and then outline the top fill in then I like to just turn the brush vertically and then just go right in and kind of just flick right up into the brow wherever I need to fill in some color switch over to the spoolie and just give them a little brush and they'll be good and set for the day. Now I'm going to go ahead and set my main foundation with my Stay Setting Spray. This one has the SPF. So give it a shake and then hold it back and just give it a liberal spray. Let that dry and then I'm going to do my eyes. Alright, here's my eyeshadow palette that I'm going to use and I just love this combination. So what do I have in here? I've got Mama, Lullaby, Tawanda, and Gilded. These two are matte and these two are our shimmers. And then I have some linen highlight that I'm going to use as a little bit more of a primer and some and a little bit of starlight powder illuminator. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is grab my multitasker brush that I use for my foundation and for um, concealing and I'm going to pick up a little bit of the linen highlight and I'm going to come in and I'm going to put that on my eyelids like a eyelid primer okay so an eyeshadow primer so I'm going to go ahead and lay that down blend it out all right I'm just going to act like a little bit of a primer and even though our um, eyeshadows are so highly pigmented and really have great last, long lasting wear. Um, sometimes for a nighttime look or for a more vibrant look, I like to put down a little bit of a lighter highlight shade on my eyes so that these colors are going to really pop. All right, I'm going to grab my eyeshadow everything brush and grab the fluffy end and pick up some of the Mama, which is this really pretty pink. And I'm going to use that as a base shade and just kind of apply that all over my lid and even kind of up a bit into the brow area, brow bone, and do the other side. All right, so I've got Mama down on my eyelid as my main kind of shadow, and now I'm gonna go in with Lullaby and pick that up again with the fluffy end of my eyeshadow everything brush, and this is gonna go out here and in the crease. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that here and then just start blending back and forth, kind of like in a windshield wiper motion and just work that right in to the crease and if you have more of a hooded eye bring it up even above so leave your eye open and apply that and blend that in really well now I'm going to go in with the more um, stubby end of my eyeshadow everything brush and dab it in to do just a little bit of contrasting right here of the gilded right in the outer corner just out here in a little triangle like that and then I'm gonna take I have to hold my eye a little taunt and just kind of bring it around the lower lower part of my eyelid along the lashes and then just in swirly motions just swirl that shade in okay and then I like to flip this side over and where the two meet just transition just do a little bit more blending okay now for a just a bit of fun we're going to add some of this Tawanda shimmer I'm going to pick it up with you know a couple different things you can use your finger and dab it right in the center just tap it on right in the center of your eye right there just to add a little pop like that or you can actually use your multitasker brush again and pick up a little bit of that and dab it right there Isn't that pretty? Let's put some on the other side with the multitasker. I'm just dabbing it on. I'm not really brushing it. I'm just more pressing it on. Okay. More bling. I'm going to take a little bit of my Starlet Illuminator and I'm going to put some way up here on the highest part of my brow and just a little bit right on the inside of my eye there just to add a pop of bright. And you know what? While you have it, you might as well grab some and put it on your cheeks. Just dab some right on the highest part of your cheekbone and then I just like to take my brush my blush brush and just tap that in a little bit all right okay summer date night ready eyes done up with a lot of fun great colors my makeup's done with Bella bronzer and my foundation from mascara 
um, I've got some illuminator and I'm ready to go. So if you thought that was a fun look or would like to know more how to use this type of makeup from mascara, then you know what you should do.